Hi, I'm Reba Hervis, Artistic Director at Overshadowed Theatrical Productions. Welcome to this week's episode, From the Wings, where I am super excited to have my music director, Tara Kaufman, with me today. She's going to be helping me with Fiddler on the Roof this summer. Thanks so much for having me. I'm so glad that you're here. So our auditions for mm -hmm. Fiddler on the Roof just got announced. Yes. Can you talk to me a little bit and share your vision for yeah. the things that you want? Yeah, absolutely. Well, I definitely think that Tevya is the main character and the most pivotal character. It is his journey of what what is important about tradition, where he starts the show kind of blindly following tradition. You do it because you do it. Um, but through the whole show, I feel like he's asking the question of, why do we do what we do? Mm -hmm. And what about tradition is good and helpful and brings us towards truth and goodness? And what is actually causing damage? Mm -hmm. And that's his journey for him as well as for his whole family. His daughters have to ask that question too. And I think that's something that's pretty timeless mm -hmm. that we, we all have to yeah. ask. In the end, they're forced to leave their village, yes. their community. And they actually sing a song, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Mm -hmm. What do we have left? You know, yeah. nothing much. But for me, I feel like if you do it right, yes, you might not have material things that are left. You might not have, you might only have a ghost town that's left here, but what you, but what you have is a community yes. will never be gone. Mm -hmm. Those relationships, that's what it's all really about. Right. And we get strengthened from so many ways. We get strengthened from the people we go to church with or the mm -hmm. people who live next door to us or yeah. people that we grew up with or our family or yeah. whatever. And I really feel like that that is very important. So what do you think is the most important character? Oh, Tevya, hands down. Yeah. Yes. Why would you say that? Um, well, first of all, I think <laughs> that for a male, that Tevya is the epic character. I do not oh, think yes. that there's any other part in musical theater that is as, as epic to play as Tevya. Yep. Mm -hmm. There's no surprise that a lot of people have already told us that they really are going to go for Tevya. Oh, yeah. Because I, I understand it. <laughs> Bring it, is, it. Show us. Yeah, it is the <laughs> part. So what you're going to have to do to show us is you're going to have to show us that you can do all those things. Yeah. He has to be a guy that from the moment he steps on stage, he has a communication with the audience mm -hmm. that you instantly love him. Yes. And as this man struggles to be the head of the house, but mm -hmm. albeit he knows he's fallible, yes. right? And you see his humanity and you see that, man, I just can't. And it's like, mm -hmm. it's hard. And, and he talks to God the whole way. Yes. And he's like, oh, Lord, if you could help me with my horse and yeah. you could help me do all these things. The very things that probably most of us pray day to day. And it just automatically makes him relatable. Yeah. And our Tevya has got to be able to do that. Mm -hmm. He has got to be able to be funny, yes. but mm -hmm. not cheeky. Right. We'll probably cast around whoever our Tevya is yes. going to be, just to be perfectly... Yes honest yeah. with everybody because he's also kind of fluid in age a little mm -hmm. bit like we could get someone who's 45 right. comes out and wants right. it we could have someone that comes out that's 60 mm -hmm. it's that's right. that's a big difference right so and it, and it will make a difference then about how old our Golda is or appears you, you guys yes. all know that stage age is different than yeah. real age but then our daughters, if we get somebody who's 45, yeah. our daughters can be a lot younger yeah. than if somebody is 60, right. you know? Mm -hmm. So those are definitely things that we're going to take into consideration. One of the things I also meant, wanted to mention is our Tevye does have to be able to move a little bit yes. too, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, you have to do the, the traditional dance. Yeah, <laughs> and you have to be able to um, move a cart around, yeah. which is, you know, lift the milk cans up and down. Mm -hmm. So there is going to be a li little bit of physicality that is going to be necessary. Yep. Now, he's married to Golda. Yes. and so I love Golda. <laughs> so what about Golda? Does she have to be able to sing? A, a little bit, but again, her acting is going to be a, a bigger portion of why we cast her. She has to have that sarcastic strength and humor, but not really meaning to be funny mm -hmm. all the time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's just, she's very sarcastic, yeah. I would say. I, I think so too, but the sarcasm needs to read in a way that we don't hate her. Right. So we still have to put this loving family together. And yeah. at the end, they, they sing a beautiful song, Do You Love Me? Mm -hmm. Where Because their marriage was arranged and, 
you know, at that particular time, nobody was like walking around telling everybody how much you loved them all the time. Right. But mm -hmm. their daughters do, right? Yeah. And their daughters are looking for love now in this new generation. He keeps hearing about the love. And so he says that and she's like, uh, what? Yeah. You're, you're upset. Go lie down. Yeah, Go to bed, you know? Um, so now then the three main daughters. Which is always my dream right there. To, yes. That was my dream was to play one of the three one daughters. Of them. You and I did. Which one? You, you, I did. I did. Oh, I wanted Huddle. Yeah. Let's be honest. Let's see. I mean, <laughs> everybody does. Why? Why is that the dream role? Because Huddle gets to sing the solo. Saito needs to be a phenomenal actress. Yes. Um, she actually doesn't have many solo singing parts. She mm -hmm. gets kind of a comedic singing point in Matchmaker, right. but she doesn't have any melodic singing points. Right, right. So that is definitely a character Do actor. we care about how they blend together? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And, um, go ahead. But, and then Hava... She does have some singing, so we'll care about her voice a little bit more, but her dancing, I think, is going to be what she really does. This it. beautiful ballet. Yeah. <laughs> Rachel Higgins is going to be our choreographer for this show. We're super excited about her doing it. So we don't know what kind of lyric she'll do. So maybe it'll be lyric, maybe it'll be ballet. Yeah. We'll see what happens with that. But it's always a very haunting piece, also for yes. me, because. Um, Tevya is just completely heartbroken yeah. at this time. And so it's Little Bird. Is that the name of the mm -hmm. song, I think? Yeah. And so she'll be flowing in the background yes. somehow. So yeah. it's very important that that character dance. That was one of my favorite yes. scenes. Guys, there are parts for you in oh, this musical. Yes. Oh, yes. And, so and not even just named ones. Like... It's a great ensemble yes. guy part, too. Yes, like, yes. So we're going to need singers and dancers. We really need athletic dancers. Unity. Okay, what about the guys that the girls end up yeah, with? Yeah, so the first one would be Mottle. Yeah. I love Mottle. Me he too. needs to be the most adorable, awkward guy yes. ever with a very good voice. Yes. <laughs> I love his He solo. sings one of my favorite songs, Wonder yeah. of Wonders. Amazing song. It's, I love it's, it. Yeah. Pure joy yes. on the stage. Yes. 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 Mm -hmm. Yeah. So he definitely will be one that we do cast based on a voice to, for, yeah. and, for but a he has to act, He has to act too. Yes. And he has to have a little bit of chemistry. Yes. 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 Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, and then there's Perchik. Yes. Perchik ends up with Huddle. And he definitely needs to be an actor. Yeah. But he also has a solo that's not in the movie. Yep. It was added for the show. Um, that's beautiful and very challenging, actually. Yeah. So yeah. he'll have to have some musical ability as well. So that will be great. And yeah. then Fiedka. Fiedka. Yes. Fiedka is actually a non-singing role. Yes. But a lot of times gets double cast as the Russian soloist in the bar scene. Yes. Do, what do you think? So, Would you do that? Or it depends on whether I think we'd have to dance. talk about it. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. If someone comes out that's not a singer but brings us the acting chops yep. that we want, I think we would go with that route. If we have a phenomenal singer yep. that we feel like really works well, because they have to have chemistry, yeah. Kava and, yeah. oh. and Fiat have 100%. to have really yeah. good chemistry, yeah. then we might go that route. So I think that will be kind of open to yeah. see what you guys bring. So guys, come and bring it. Yes, absolutely. As our auditions are coming up soon, yeah. as, are there any hopes, desires, fears, anything that now you're thinking about? Um, well, I think that because this is a musical about community, mm -hmm. right? I'm really excited to see what community we get to bring oh, to Overshadowed. I love that. Because I do think this show fosters in a way that a lot of mu other musicals might not naturally yeah, foster, yeah, yeah. but that community aspect. Because even if you are townsperson number 20 in it, yeah. you will have a family. Right. Everybody right. has a family, that family union, and it needs to be believable from yes. the minute that that first tradition happens and people jump onto the stage. Yeah, I love it. You have to see those family connections, the friend connections. Yep. Um, and so that just helps foster it in real life during I, that process. I love that so much. Every once in a while, a musical comes along that does that. Yeah for the community and then it lives to tell about it for years. Oh, absolutely. People have become friends and it's like, oh yeah, this is our group from when we th yep. did this together. You so have all I, the group chats that I continue know, on for years. I <laughs> love that so much and I am with you. I hope that that happens again this time. Mm -hmm. So for you guys out there in the world of audition land or if somebody out there is thinking about doing this play for your community theater or your high school, I would say 100%. This is this is a gem of a show. Yes. It gets a lot of people involved. The music is haunting. Mm -hmm. There's nothing, I think, that would be questionable about it. I love this show. 
I hope that if you live around this area that you will come and audition and try yes. out with us. We would Please love do. to work with you. So I'm so <laughs> excited to get to work with her. And I'm so excited to work with yeah, you. This is going to be the most fun summer. Yes. We would love to have you be a part of it as well. So until next time, this is just me. And me. Talking to you from, from the, the Wings. wings.